Welcome back. This is still Tea Time on Plus TV Africa. We're having an interesting conversation yes, really. on Love Island, but we need to move on because we're talking about people finding love. And we're now we're about to talk about people falling out of love as Dr. Dre's estranged wife, Nicole Young, is accused of draining their company bank account dry after writing herself a check of 363000 plus as she accuses rap mogul of hiding assets. She's accused of blatant and unjustifi unjustifiable criminal and embezzlement of corporate funds by attorney Ed McPherson and a representative for the limited liability company LLC responsible for managing record one young filed the paperwork for their divorce on Monday June 29 citing the usual irreconcilable differences as the reason for a split from the hip-hop mogul so people are finding love and so people are falling out of love mm. and they are writing their self checks what okay. do you guys think you know, things like this always kind of slap me into reality a bit because I can I really can't be a love love person, you know, mm. like I just you're feel not like, a man of love. I I yeah, yeah, <laughs> mm. yeah, in the you know, like I feel like this type of things because the for me what really stood out was how do you go from loving each other for so many years mm. to going behind each other's backs writing checks, playing with a lot of money. Mm. It seems like money's not the focus or like properties and who wants to settle um, with the most wins. It's, it's, like, it's like they've become honestly, enemies. Yeah. Uh, I honestly, don't know how that happens. Yeah, honestly, yeah. I, I just feel like marriage out there, outside this country right now, is just mm. more like a business. Yeah. Mm. Like if I get married to a very rich man, and then I just want to get tired. I want to leave. Just sites irreconcilable irre irre yeah. differences. differences. And all of a sudden, I'm rich. It just, he's not Jeff Bezos. Jeff Bezos' wife and his wife split. And then she became the third richest person. I mean, the third richest person and in the world. And that was and what? richest what? woman we, in the world. That is, take, it's crazy. Gonna, oh, but even with that, are we going to take away the fact that this, these women have done years? So, Like, if it was a three-year relationship, are we able to buy that theory easily? But th do you think mm. that somebody will be in the relationship for 20-something years 24. with the end goal in mind to just take money? You know what? You know what? When, when, when issues like, like this come up, yeah, yeah I'm a woman. And I don't like to always see it from only the woman's part of view, point mm. of view. Mm. Because, yes, she True. gave a lot. I demand to give gave a lot. lot. It takes yeah. two to tango. tango. Because for me, there's actually nothing you're pointing out. I mean, if you come like, oh, he hit me or he bit me up. And mm. people will be like, okay, women right to come like, okay, you have a right to mm. leave. But now that the difference is we don't even know. And from when I read the list of the things she's asking for, brother, it is not about, oh, I'm hot, I want to leave. Mm. It is about Close ripping $2 million off monthly the guy. Spouse support. Yeah. You're talking about money for shopping. You're calling hundreds of thousands of dollars. Just keep the baby girl lifestyle. I mean, come on. the first black rap billionaire before mm. after he sold beats by Dre and yeah. then yeah he, he became he, he wasn't a billionaire anymore because he sold maybe she was assets, hurt but. and then now she's, she's she just want to rip him off mm. okay so um answering your question where you said that um you've been together for so many years it baffles me as well that you've been married to somebody for many years I believe a relationship is up, supposed to uplift the both of us right mm -hmm. so in as much as I'm married to a woman I should be able to grow from my relationship with you mm. what are you bringing to the table so when most of these women come with these allegations and things they want to go away with so my question is what have you been bringing to the table that you cannot take away mm. when you're mm -hmm. leaving that is when you're in a relationship think of what you're bringing to the table so that when you're leaving i could take this away and when the man has that at the exactly. back of his mind that mm. she's going to take this away mm. it will be of his best it will sit up but you, you know what you know what that idea companionship yeah but you know that idea yeah you can only think about about that as a Nigerian I don't yeah. know but you see those people it's as if they are brain part of their brain they, they bring it from somewhere else it's not from this yet mm. they can sit down tomorrow and this coffee that we are drinking right now can turn into a problem that will lead to a divorce mm. he didn't get me coffee in the morning oh I'm emotionally starved because he didn't get me breakfast in bed and that's the whole reason for you to leave the relationship. Yeah, so we, I think we, our mindset is quite different from Yeah, them. we like to so ahead in this country. Be ah! till, till so I just think, I just, just say I this. Die in that marriage. Oh, my right my general advice to women, yeah. in as much as you can be blinded by love, mm. open one eye, you know? Small. Blind one. They don't afford open these days, one. bros. bros and Jaru, make sure. Jaru, they don't afford these days. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Jaru. They kind of look alike. Okay, Jaru. Jaru. Is like. he around? Oh, we have a guest. <laughs> All right, we need to go on a break. And maybe Jaru will be our guest. But stay tuned, tea time. We'll be right back.